It is a major victory for the Obama administration. And our region's Washington representatives did not wait long to react to today's Supreme Court ruling that upholds the individual insurance requirement at the heart of the president's historic federal health care overhaul. In a 5-4 to four decision, the court rejected arguments that Congress went too far in requiring most Americans to have health insurance or pay a penalty. The decision means the major changes will proceed, ultimately impacting the way millions of Americans receive and pay for their personal medical care. Reactions been split along party lines. Democrat Congressman Maurice Hinchy applauded the court for, in his words, not allowing politics to interfere with its job of upholding the Constitution, saying the Affordable Care Act will provide the country its greatest health care victory since Medicare and Medicaid. And Democrat Senator Kirsten Gillibrand said uh, the ruling reaffirms the progress being made to ensure that uh, no one can be denied coverage. But Republicans see the president's health care program as a huge tax increase that fails to address rising costs while hurting small business. GOP Congresswoman Nan Hayworth vowed to work with other Republicans to repeal the legislation that she says harms rather than helps patients. And fellow Hudson Valley Republican Congressman Chris Gibson said the health care law, quote, steps on our freedoms. Look for more on the Supreme Court decision and its impact, as well as a further local reaction here at Record Online and in Friday's Times-Herald Record.